everything so you know how it is like I started everything was fine a month or two down the line we broke up <laughs> <laughs> Uh-huh. It's heels in the building. Sit down, relax, baby. Let me take you on a ride. Sit down, relax, baby. Let me take you on a ride. Yeah, yeah. Welcome to my roller coaster. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it's your first time here, thank you so much for tuning in. And if you're a returning subscriber, hey, thank you so much for coming back. You guys, we hit 20,000 subscribers. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I am still so like, I can't believe it. It, it. it honestly still feels unreal. And as we speak, I just checked, we're actually on 21,000. I'm so happy, I'm so excited, and I just wanna say thank you to everybody who joined the family, okay? You guys, I, I, I can't believe it. it. It's still, like I said, it just feels so unreal. And in today's video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys my YouTube journey, okay? We're gonna be talking about how we got here, all the highs, all the lows, Yes, how we got to 20, 21,000 subscribers. I'm saying 20 because that was a very big milestone for me. And yes, so we're going to get into all of that. And of course, at the end of this video, I have something so, so exciting for you guys. I'm going to do a giveaway finally. And I'm so excited for this giveaway because it's big, okay? And you're going to love it. And you're going to want to win. So you make sure you guys watch till the end. Yes, but before we get into this video, you guys know the drill. I need you guys to hit the subscribe button if you're new join the family join be part of us honey hello <laughs> join the family hit the subscribe button make sure you give this video a big fat thick thumbs up okay make sure you hit the little bell right next so that you don't miss any video when I post and without further ado let's get right into the video okay you guys so I started my channel in September 2018 yes um, if you guys want like the full details and why I started the channel and all of that I'm gonna leave the video right up here it was my very first video and I talked about all of that in detail so you can go watch that video if you want to but yes you guys I haven't had the easiest of journeys on YouTube okay so a quick story time <laughs> come close come close quick story time okay so when I started my channel you guys I did not have any technical skills or any equipment to be a youtuber okay i didn't know how to edit i knew nothing about editing i didn't have a camera i i had nothing okay i just knew that i wanted to be a youtuber but i had no technical skills i had no equipment to be a youtuber so <laughs> my boyfriend at the time my ex-boyfriend used to edit my youtube videos what did you say so <laughs> the tea anyway <laughs> my ex-boyfriend used to edit my videos and I used to borrow a camera yes from one guy from my school for my sit down videos and when I had to vlog you guys I had a very crappy phone this phone right here my very loyal iPhone 6 small phone this was the phone I had this is this is like 16 gig I think <laughs> very small memory I couldn't do anything on it so I used to use his phone and everything so you know how it is like I started everything was fine a month or two down the line we broke up <laughs> uh -huh. so we broke up and there I was I don't know how to edit this guy's been doing all of these things and I'm just like the ghetto oh, the ghetto the ghetto Ghetto. The actual ghetto, you guys. So I had to go off YouTube for like three months. Yeah, I think it was like three or four months. I had to go off YouTube because there was nothing I could do. So during those three, during those three months, I had to teach myself how to edit. I learned how to edit, you guys, and I had to figure it out. One of my very good friends, shout out to you, Sabali. Yes, Savari and I would literally always meet up and just figure this out because he had little knowledge 
about it and we're just trying to figure it out together i downloaded one the shape filmora which is the software i still use to date yes so downloaded the software just learned how to do it so in those three months i learned how to edit in those three months i built my business okay for those of you that i knew i have a business page on instagram bags with sass y'all go follow my page okay support your girl okay so yes i was so serious with my business everything just worked in my favor by the end of those three months i managed to get myself my camera the one i'm using right now for my birthday yes so after that i was able to come back on youtube and i started making content anyway that's just to show you guys how you know it wasn't smooth in the beginning so i came back on youtube i started making content i think i i started making videos again um in like february 2019 February I started making content you guys I was so gassed I was like I can edit I have a camera so I started making videos even though I wasn't very consistent I was doing my best and in May 2019 I reached my first 1,000 subscribers I was so so happy I remember I celebrated yes I got a thousand subscribers in May 2019 and then after that the growth was still slow it was very slow but then I was doing my best even though I was not very consistent so I would post videos probably like once in two weeks once in three weeks it was never like every week or like twice a week but then I had my first mini blow up when I made this video where I went to get my hair done in a Chinese hair salon so that video was a trend at the time you know every um, black female youtuber in China was making that video and I know two girls who made that video and got a million views one of them became a very good friend of mine Sarah Kiola yes so I hopped on to that you know and then I made that video and it worked out for me I got I think now it has like 97,000 views at the time it was like oh my gosh I remember when I got 10k views I was like <laughs> I was so excited but that was the first time YouTube was recommending my video out to more people and I had like a lot of subscribers come my way and by the end of the year in 2019 I had 2,000 subscribers so yes now as you guys can see it's been very slow by end of 2019 I had only 2,000 subscribers so now 2020 came and quarantine happened coronavirus coronavirus the corona happened you guys and it was a blessing in disguise for me because I had more time on my hands to make content. I had already planned so many things because during that time it was going to be my winter winter break from school. And I was like, I'm going to have a lot of time to make content. So when the corona started in January, I was on a roll. Guys, when I tell you I was on a roll, I was making videos three times a week. For those of you guys who've been subscribed for the, for that long, like from day one, y'all know I was posting videos three times a week, twice a week. I, I just, I was so consistent. And this is when my channel started to grow, you know, faster. So the very first tip that I will tell you in order to, you know, grow your channel is you need to be consistent. So now how consistency works is if you're consistent you're making videos regularly you get more watch time and the more watch time you get the youtube algorithm will see that okay this person has a lot of watch time so they will her, her content is probably interesting so it will recommend your videos to other people so yes the next thing that really helped the channel grow was that i started making relevant content of course i feel like most of my content is relevant because then y'all know i make content about life as a black girl in china experiences in china and all of that but what i mean is because of what was happening at the time coronavirus and everything i was making videos to kind of educate people on the situation and what it was like here in china because at the time it was just china <laughs> that had the rona and because of that my videos brought in a lot of a lot of traffic because everyone was like watching like oh my gosh what's happening in china and all of that so i made relevant content that was the second thing that helped the channel grow the third thing was that i started showing my personality a lot more not to say like in the beginning i wasn't showing my personality but i always felt like you know when i started my channel i had to speak in a certain way or in a certain manner i had to you know do this and this on camera and i remember my friends were like sammy you you need to be yourself <laughs> 
So I started like I feel like I'm much more free to be my crazy self and you know I can literally come and say all the rubbish I want and y'all will love it. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> yeah, so I started showing my personality a lot more. A lot of you guys always tell me that you know your your personality is bomb and all of that. So that's the third thing you need to be yourself you need to show your personality because there's so guys there's so many youtubers like there's so many youtube channels so many youtubers and we want to see like me speaking from a viewer's perspective not as a creator whenever i watch other people on youtube i love to see people who are original people who are themselves so that really really helped me and then the fourth thing was that i improved my editing so because we're in lockdown and i had much more free time Time with my hands I started playing a lot with my software you know trying out new things and also I, I started improving the way I edited my videos you guys can see all the transitions all the you know all that little sauce that wasn't there in my videos before I started implementing that and then another thing is that I love to make people laugh like I am someone among my amongst my friends I'm the clown <laughs> okay I'm the one who's always telling the dry joke don't leave me, don't leave me, don't leave me. Making people laugh. I love funny memes. I'm always sharing memes back and forth with my friends. So I started incorporating that into my videos, you know, trying to use these memes and these little clips to make my videos more interesting. So I just started editing my videos better and I noticed that I started getting a lot more people who were coming to the channel. And then the fifth thing that also helped us get where we are today is I feel like I started making content that was a little bit more relatable so instead of me always of course most of the times I have to glam up come on here looking all you know <laughs> looking like a painting or whatever but I also started you know shooting more videos in my natural no makeup home kind of vibe do you know what i mean and i also got a lot of people who say oh my gosh you you're so relatable and all of that for example one video that blew up was the skincare video when i was talking about how i suffer from acne and hyperpigmentation and i just shared like my journey you know trying out the turmeric mask and you know that video also just this period i think it started blowing up three months after I posted it but still it was like one video that also brought in like a lot of subscribers yes yeah, so be relatable you know not just that I also mean there's a time when I made the story time <laughs> you guys last you like things that's the problem <laughs> you guys like story times yes yeah, so I, I made the story time and just like sharing part of my part of my life with you guys and that also helps people connect with you you know I feel like a lot more people can connect with me because y'all can relate we all been played by these niggas you know what I'm saying <laughs> yes yeah, so I started making content that was a little bit more relatable and that worked to our advantage and then the sixth thing was that I made content I started making content that was trending so it is what it is guys that that's that's the YouTube game the hop on to trends I remember you know when the don't rush challenge started there and then me and my girls were like we need to make this video we made that video and it also blew up you know I also got like a lot of subscribers from that and of course the one the big blow <laughs> my video where I did the Chloe Ting abs workout challenge that got to a million views yes you know if you're gonna be a youtuber even though of course you're gonna be making content that everyone else is making add your own touch to it that's what's going to make you stand out because guys there's so many people who have who are doing this Chloe Ting abs workout challenge but it's it, by the grace of God obviously mine managed to get a million views because I feel like I was myself I was just you know really relatable you know and yeah Okay, you guys, so before I get into this video, I just want to share with you guys a very short testimony. I shared this with you guys on my Instagram. By the way, if you're not following me on Instagram, cut the cameras. Dead ass. Baby, what are you doing? Go follow me on Instagram. I'm going to leave my handle right here. Go follow me on Insta. Let's be friends, okay? But yeah, when the year started, I... I had 2,000 subscribers, okay? January 1, I had 2,000 subscribers. And in my head, I remember when I was writing down my goals and just like, you know, praying about my year and everything, I was like, God, you know what? Realistically speaking, realistically speaking, 
me showing my lack of faith but anyway <laughs> realistically speaking if I put in the work this year by the end of the year I should have 10k subscribers so that was I remember I actually wrote that down right but then I was like my god you know what you're a god of miracles I don't know how I don't know where who what I, I don't know okay but by your grace i am going to have 20k subscribers by end of this year you know because for me it was like 2020 20k you know 20 for 20 you know what i'm saying yes so i remember i prayed and i was like 2020 20k for 2020 by the end of the year you know and for the first three months guys i say this prayer i remember i talked to some of my best friends about it and one of my very close friends tawia would always pray about it like 20k 2020 so when i reached 20k guys we're only in june just half the year and i got 20k subscribers to me it was like oh my god wow oh my god so mind-blowing like you know god always just exceeds my expectations like no joke you guys yes yeah, so the, the, which is why you know this whole 20k thing is very big for me because it's a very powerful testimony for me and in my life and y'all know i really love being a creator and i love doing this i put a lot of time and energy into it so it's really good to feel like you know you're actually getting rewarded for all your hard work so yes you guys which is why we're doing this we're doing this video right here <laughs> and also the giveaway is just like a very big thank you to every one of you guys who subscribe because I love you y'all make this possible okay without you we wouldn't be having all of this so yes we're gonna get right into the giveaway now this giveaway is in collaboration with face bags a lot of you guys always ask me to plug you guys with like the best replica designer you know there's no there's there's no shame in being bougie on a budget okay most of us i know most of you guys who watch my channel are like you know 20s y'all are still trying to make it we we can we all know we cannot afford ten thousand dollar louis vuitton fifteen thousand dollar gucci you know so there's absolutely no shame in being pushy on a budget so i'm bringing you guys this video in collaboration with face bags let me just tell you guys a little bit more about face bags they are a manufacturing company based here in china and they make good quality replica designer bags and shoes so i'm gonna leave all the details in the description box and i'm gonna probably pin a comment to this video but i really want you guys to check them out okay their prices are so so good for the quality it's also good and like i said the giveaway so we're gonna get into unboxing they sent me a package oh my god they sent me a package which we're gonna unbox right here and whatever is in here i'm gonna be giving it away to one of you guys we're gonna get into the details of the giveaway soon after we unbox so let's get into the unboxing okay oh wow so it comes in this it comes in like a plastic and then there's like a cloth bag inside so let's open the plastic and see wow oh my god it's so heavy it's so heavy so it's in this cloth bag it says Louis Vuitton it's a cloth bag oh my gosh you guys no way so it's also in like this form rubber brand new oh oh my god wow 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 you guys the quality it's so it's so heavy it feels so heavy and oh, I want you guys to look at that can you guys see that it's so thick and wow the leather feels so so thick like genuine leather do you know what i mean oh my gosh you guys this bag is mad oh i'm guessed <laughs> i am so oh my gosh now i'm really contemplating whether i want to give this away <laughs> it's so nice you guys so you guys can see all the zips all the zips have the logo LV 
LV. Oh my gosh. I want you guys to see all the details. It says Louis Vuitton. So we're gonna open it. Oh my gosh. So inside there's a, I think this is like Louis Vuitton. So this is like an extra belt. Extra belt actually. Oh my gosh, you guys, do you see that? Louis Vuitton Paris. And it's such good leather. I am in love! Y'all can see the detail, baby! Can you guys see the details though? Like, wow. This bag is so pretty, you guys. Like, this is, I've wanted this bag for the longest time. Like, y'all just look at that. It's like the perfect bougie travel kind of bag. Yes. So I'm gonna leave all the details in the description box. They have this. This is the Damier Canvas Keep Call bag. I hope I'm saying that right. But yes, this one is slightly more expensive, but they also have the monogram, which is the, the, the design that, you know, the conventional Louis Vuitton design. Yes, but I love, I love, love, love this canvas design. I need you guys to check them out. They have absolutely amazing quality and for the price for this quality, honestly if you compare this to like the actual little to no differences that you can spot you know, I really really love this. And just for you guys if you're gonna buy anything from face bags, you guys can use my discount code SIPOSAMI15 USD and you get 15 US dollars off of your order okay so check them out guys yeah, yeah you gotta you gotta be bougie okay all right you guys so like i said i'm gonna be giving away this gorgeous baby i'm gonna be giving her away to one of you guys because that's how much y'all mean to me okay i really want to show my appreciation so i'm giving away this bag yes the rules are very very simple okay just five simple steps the first one is you need to be subscribed okay you need to be part of this family so you need to make sure that you're subscribed to my youtube channel you are notification gang like turn on those post notifications baby <laughs> so make sure you subscribe the second thing is you need to be following me on instagram okay my instagram handle is sipo.sammy underscore x or you can just search for just sipo sammy make sure you follow me on instagram the third step is you need to tag at least three of your friends. So I've made this post on Instagram, okay? Y'all can see it. If you go on my page right now, you're gonna see this post. Make sure you tag three of your friends under that post. Make sure those friends subscribe to the channel and they also follow me on Instagram. The fourth step is those friends are gonna come to this video and mention you. So let's say you are Nancy, Nancy, your friends, you have tagged your friends, your friends need to come to this video and comment tagged by at Nancy blah 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 your Instagram handle. The more friends of yours that come and mention you in this video that you've tagged on my Instagram, the higher chances of winning the bag. The fifth step is you need to share that Instagram post on your IG story so that more people can see the post. So very simple you guys, five simple steps. Make sure you're subscribed, make sure you follow me on Instagram, tag three of your friends and make sure those friends follow me and subscribe and then they come and tag you on this video so that you stand a chance to win the bag. And then the fifth step, all of you just make sure you share that Instagram post to your Instagram stories. I know it may seem like a lot, but you guys, this this bag ain't cheap. Like, have y'all seen her? Hey, do you know how much that nigga costs? It's expensive. And I want to make sure that whoever wins this bag is truly deserving. By the way, I have a software or an app that helps me track who, who's subscribed and who isn't and who's following me and who isn't. So don't think you can cheat your way into this, okay? You have to make sure you're subscribed and following me. Anyway, thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I am glad that I've shared my experience, like my YouTube journey and how it's been. 
And I'm also glad to be doing the giveaway. May the best subby win. I'm so excited. Y'all make sure you check out face bags. Like I said, I'm gonna leave all their details in the description box below. Don't forget to use my discount code Siposami15 USD for all your purchases. Get yourself some designer, baby. Don't break your bank balance to look rich. Affordable designer bags, affordable designer shoes, belts, you name it, on their website. All details will be left in the description box. This is not the only giveaway. I'm gonna be doing a lot more giveaways. Y'all just stick with me, we're a family. I love you guys so much, so yes. More giveaways are gonna be coming, that's for sure. Okay, thank you guys so much for watching. Do make sure you give this video a big fat, big thumbs up, subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!